Oh, yes, lots <laughs> coming up on your Feel Good Breakfast show. Now, Mikhail Bougeli, better known as Mishu, is a Lebanese-born award-winning barista who has been in the coffee business for over a decade. And through his Mishu coffee shop, he's won the title for Best Espresso and Cappuccino in Cape Town and Best Cappuccino in South Africa in 2012. Now, since then, Mishu has trained over 1,000 baristas in Cape Town, well, in South Africa, rather, in a quest to share his passion for coffee. Now, you can catch him tonight night that's on top billing but before then Mishu joins us in studio alongside his apprentice Theo Makiva to tell us more about his training business and it's great having you gents in studio thank you thank you, thank you for having us well uh, Mishu I first have to ask you first I mean you've been in the business for over 10 years you've trained thousands um, what made you decide to share your your love for coffee coffee has changed my life in 2005 and got me to where I am now so I'd like to share it with as many people as possible and help them changing their lives. Okay, now Theo, you've been working very closely with Mikhail. What's that experience been like? It's been an awesome journey. Yeah, he's a very nice uh, guy. And he's been uh, helping me out. And I've been under his wing. And um, I appreciate him for that day. Eh? Oh, well, you know what? I'm getting all these amazing coffee aromas. You've got the Isabella blend here. And tell us the story behind the Isabella blend. Isabella blend was born the week my daughter was born. And I couldn't find any better name to give my coffee blend. Okay. So you're going to give us, you're going to be cooking up one, a, a demonstration for us. Correct. So talk me through what are you about to do? So we're about to show you how to prepare the cold brew at home. It's uh, one of the easiest way to make cold coffee at home and then turn it into serve it as cold or hot. Okay. Okay. So let's start. What so are we all, gonna start all what with? You, all what you need is 125 grams of uh, freshly ground Isabella blend, very coarse, and you pour 750 milliliter of uh, room temperature or cold water over it. Okay. So normally when I make coffee, you know, I, I always assumed it had to be hot water, even if you're going to be serving it cold. So why do you choose the cold water? Uh, using cold water allows the coffee's acidity to be much softer on the palate. And with Isabella blend, it, uh, with, as a cold version of uh, making it, it tastes very nutty. You feel like you're drinking hazelnut syrup. Ah, so that's the secret. So um, how long will that have to stand like that? So after we give it a gentle stir, we close it and we give it about 48 hours to 48 steep. 48 hours, okay. Either in the fridge or at the room temperature. <laughs> okay. And then once the 48 hours is done, what will it look like? It will look like this. We'll be left with a dark, is, can you call it a syrup? It's, it's a coffee concentrate. Coffee. Okay. It's not very thick, but it's very flavorful. The coffee concentrate, awesome. Then what are you gonna do with that? Okay, we're gonna show you two ways of preparing it at home. The cold version, which is uh, on the rocks. Uh, all what you need is ice blocks, some cold milk, I have to ask you this question. So I've, um, I've argued with friends before, what goes first when you make a cup of coffee? Is it always the milk or does the milk come second? If you prepare cappuccinos at home, you first put the espresso and then you pour the foamy milk over that to allow the flavor of the espresso to infuse throughout the foam. Okay. At home, it depends how you prepare your coffee, but uh, usually if you make a plunger, you pour your plunger and then you add a dash of milk if needed. Yes, okay, cool, so there's no specific way. Okay, so you're making one on the rocks. Yes, so on the rocks we'll do cold milk, ice blocks, and 50 milliliter of Isabella cold brew. So Theo, you've mastered this now. You you know how to do this in your sleep. <laughs> oh, I'm still learning. You're still learning. I'm still learning, yeah. Okay, so I'll give this one a try and then you're gonna make us a hot one as well. Correct, so to be like a hot Americano, mm -hmm. instead of making hot espresso with your espresso machine, if you don't always have an espresso machine, you can make cold brew at home as easy as this. Yes. And then pour cold brew Isabella. Oh, this is incredible. Okay, so you just put in one shot. And hot water. And hot water, pretty straightforward. Oh, fantastic. Now, where can people get a hold of your Isabella blend? Uh, we distribute it to various coffee shops around the country. It's available on our website, misho.co.za. We also have an online shop. And uh, they're always welcome to visit our shop in Seapoint, 85 Regent Road. Ah, oh, we will. Well, we'll, we'll do and then. Well, thank you so much for joining us. Theo, lovely meeting you as well. Now, you can catch these two on top billing tonight. That's at 8 p.m. with a repeat on Sunday. That's at half past 12 in the afternoon to get a closer look at an award-winning coffee experience. Well, listen, we still have lots coming up for you on your Feel Good Breakfast show.